It was uh, April. Uh, I took my first uh, spring bike ride with my little dog, uh, Sophie. And we just went around the block three or four times, came back in, and the next morning, swelling started increasing, pain, there was an increase in pain. His foot was approximately twice the size it should be. There was a lot of inflammation and redness. So as a nurse, I was very concerned about that. Joe does have a history of cellulitis, where that the tissue swell, there's a lot of redness, there's uh, a lot of times hot to the touch. And the symptoms seemed like it just kept getting worse. I felt like there was a band that was around my foot. Uh, cutting off the circulation is very painful to walk upon. I went into the kitchen and I was praying inside of myself, what should we do, you know? Which physician do we go to, what course of action? And I turned on the 700 Club, which is kind of my practice when I come in and fix supper. And Pat Robertson was on the segment where they were praying for people and calling out words of knowledge. Somebody has got a swollen foot. Uh, it, it perhaps is an infection in your foot or your toe, but it's the swelling. It's like a bandage wrapped around it. God is healing you right now in Jesus' name. He described the symptoms so accurately. And my wife yelled from the kitchen, Joe, claim that. And I said, I am, baby. The next morning, the swelling started to go down, the pain was gone, fever had not come back, it left me, and the redness started to go away. It took about two or three days for it to happen, but uh, when uh, Pat gave that special word, it started the breakthrough, it started the healing process. It's so dramatically better that I'm so thankful for. God changed the situation. God is all powerful, God is all caring, God meets our needs, and He intervened. I can do the things of a normal, what a normal person can do now, whereas before it was very difficult, very painful, and I had to most of the time keep my feet up. It's just a little reaffirmation that He loves us and He wants to take care of us. And of course, if God did it for me, He's no respecter person, He'll be able to do it for others also.